Okay, here's the second lesson on the one string diddly bow. In the first lesson, we showed you the magic note. We took a pencil and we marked where that magic note was. The way we found this was we played smoke on the water. Whatever tuning it was in, it's not even exactly in a G tuning right now. It's, it's wherever I tuned it up to, but it doesn't matter. Let's uh, do smoke on the water again. Remember, the magic note was the first note that you touched on here. There's your magic note. So, dun, 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 dun. Well, check this out. Let's mark a second note. Dun, dun, dun. That one right there. Right there. Let's mark that one. Okay, so now we have two marks on our fretboard. Now check this out. With these two marks, we can do the classic Muddy Waters, I'm a man chug. Where we go, I'm going to put this, it's tough filming your own videos, but there we go. Watch this, if you go, bam. there you go. Notice how I use this finger to just kind of deaden the string when I need to. So there we go. There's your second little lesson. Okay, let's put one more mark on here. Um, let's find out where the octave is, and the octave means it's the same note in the beginning as it is halfway up the neck. Um, it's just one octave higher. Find whatever the open note is, find that same note one octave higher. Hear that? Let's put a mark right there on our fretboard. Right about there. The reason we're putting that there is that adds a nice little flourish note. This this octave right there. Let's go back to our Muddy Waters Blues thing. There you go. Lesson number two for Diddly Bow. It doesn't have to be complicated. Make it easy on yourself. If you have to take a pencil and write on it, hey, do it. It'll help you navigate around the neck. So there you go. My name's Shane Spiel. You want some more information, go to shanespiel.com. And hey, if you're ever in the Pittsburgh area, go check out Spiel's Tavern, New Alexandria, PA. It's home of the Cigar Box Guitar Museum. So there we go. Play your instrument. Play it proudly, even if it's a simple one string. Till next time, I'm Shane.